you know what day it is? Finally Friday. It's finally Friday. Fourth of July giveaway. What are we doing here? Yes, we have actually been running that for about two weeks now. Uh, you have this week and next week. We're going to draw next Friday. Wow. Yeah. Um, it's actually been sitting back there on the back wall, and I have just forgot to talk about it. <laughs> so is it the grill? Is yes. What you get? Pellet grill. Yeah, it's that uh, Green Mountain yeah. Grills. Um, that's cool. Everybody I've talked to, they said that was a really good brand. So. That's nice. It is, and it's simple ways to enter. Easy enough, huh? It is. It gives, um, we didn't want to just uh, focus on one thing. So as you can tell there, mm -hmm. $100 purchase, that is added on to your regular truck account. So like you have a truck account, you add $100, you get a ticket. Good thing about our tickets, kind of cutting that one short real quick is, so normally whenever you do tickets, we have a whole row here, you have a number. You keep one, I keep one, we throw it in there. Then we have to go about the whole headache of who got a ticket, I lost mine, that yeah. was my number, you know. Well, we decided because it's gonna be on Friday and we're fingers crossed that, you know, business is good enough that we can take that week of the fourth off. We just wrote your name on the back of the ticket. There you go. <laughs> so I've been verifying everybody's phone numbers and stuff like that. So if you get a call from an unknown number on a Friday evening, <laughs> it could be you that won you the won grill. the grill. Answer the phone. That's it. <laughs> we have some people, they actually, I tried to call them yesterday because we go to some factories and we deal with maintenance. Well, we don't go inside the factory because, sure. you know, sometimes they have different rules like hard hat, steel toe mm -hmm. boots, which is fine. So we want to go by their protocol. I actually tried to call the guy and it went straight to voicemail. I was like, well, they must not have service. So I have three people that I call there. The other two answered. Well, the other one gets on here and I said, well, is so-and-so here? And they said, oh, well, he has everybody's numbers blocked. I was like, well, all right. And okay. he's like, yeah. He said, if he don't know your number, it automatically forwards. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, all right. So he gets on here and I said, well, you know, you had a ticket to win this. I said, but my phone number got forwarded. So I guess you're just not gonna, you know, get a chance to win it. And he's like, oh, wow. So he put our, our number in there as right. Maco. So. I'm bad about that. If I don't have your number saved, I don't answer it. Just because <laughs> I get this, you qualify for a $26,000 per employee tax credit phone oh, yeah. call like 50 times a day or Google my business. It's just it's ridiculous. I'm telling you, look, last week I left here and I have like four or five more shops. Then I go to a big equipment shop, which is no big deal. I pull up and they'll come out. Well, about the time I was getting out from the front seat coming back here because they had already kind of beat me around to the door, I got a phone call from an older man <laughs> and he is giving me a current over. Like, and I'm like, I don't even know who you are. Like, I couldn't <laughs> even say hello. Apparently a telemarketer has got my phone number oh, no. and has been calling his number. And I said, look, I said, they have messaged me off my own number. So, I, you know, I don't know. <laughs> You done got to cuss it for a time. I, I was like, I hadn't even called you. I don't even know who you are. But anyways, back on the giveaway subject. Sorry it veered off. But uh, we did different ways. That way everybody could be sure. a chance to win. Uh, so I said the $100 purchase, uh, a scheduled truck payment. As you see in parentheses, it says it must go through. You would be surprised how many people set up payments and they do not go through. Wow. So if you are one of those people, your Make name. sure you got money in your account. Exactly. Don't schedule a payment if it can't go through. I mean, honestly, that looks bad. <laughs> <laughs> and then it kind of makes the distributor a little more less trustworthy of you, you know. And then a PSA purchase, which, you know, is like the carts, mm. the toolboxes. I mean, if you have a PSA, I think it's $300 minimum to add. But I think that's just for writing a contract and stuff like that. Um, and then you can just start a truck account for a hundred dollars. So, there you go. and everybody's different. I know there's a bunch of distributors doing a giveaway. It's, you know, everybody's got different things. That's just how y'all be doing it. Exactly. That's it. <laughs> well, I like you got the purple on display over here. That looks good. Yeah, we're waiting on the big old purple. half inch ratchet. Yes, purple screwdrivers is what I'm waiting on. So purple screwdriver. So we can just have the full line. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And I believe they said our Infinium line is actually going purple also. Well, y'all so, got every other color except blue. I think all our blue is sold. Don't say no. that. Don't say that. <laughs> 
Yes. This is the color I got, and I really like that color, that sort of high vis green, yellowish. You know, and honestly, that color cleans up so it does. well. And a lot of people yeah. are like, well, I don't want to do that color. I want to do like red because, you know, it's going to get dirty mm -hmm. anyways. And when it cleans, it still looks red. I said, well, honestly, I've had people come up here and they'll be like, I need this screwdriver. Well, look at the part number. It's not. Well, they had greasy hands, so you yeah. have to wipe it back off and stick it back on the ceiling. Sure. Cleans up good. I have to get y'all some tub of tiles in here. You know, we had them Things and work. they just kind of went through. So They worked. They do. So seeing you back there by the Pocket Mate Streamlight, so yep. you know we have those. Yeah, they're awesome too. They are. Well, I have got my hands on the Maxion Amigo. Yep. I think it's what I don't want to mispronounce that. Those get... are good too because I got one of them too. Yes. So as you can see, size wise, it's just mm -hmm. a hair bigger, but. Open that thing up and show well, everybody what it can do. That thing's impressive. I, wanna, wanna, I can help you out whoop. if you get stuck because I actually read the package before I opened mine. Well, you might have to do that. So, you have your clip here, right? Yep, carabiner. Yeah, well, see, I don't know the professional name of that. <laughs> you have a the, bottle opener for your that's Coke. That's the best part. Coke. Who opens Coke with that? Well, you know. When's you the last know. time you had a bottle of Coke that had to you pop know. the top on? Michael actually went through a phase where we had to actually call the Coke company and get bottled Cokes because that's all he would drink. So he drank some with no ice too, right? Yes, no ice. Yeah, that's, what that's I was okay. Saying. Oh yeah. And then you have its a C charger, which USB is fantastic yep. unless you have an iPhone, and then you're just, you know, how that works. So you have your magnet, and it has a clip right there. Mm -hmm. So well, show everybody. Here's a pry bar, so it'll be easy to do. All right. Show everybody so how good clip. the magnet actually works on that. So there, let me turn my pry bar so you can see, and then, as you can tell, which I have that in the way, so I'll do it this way. So and guys, the magnet strong enough to actually hold it on there while she adjusts it. That's exactly. what makes that one awesome. And then to pull it off, you know, you might have to just grab and pull because that's yep. a strong magnet. It is strong. So. So. 700 lumens so show them what yes. makes this light cool because it's not just one light it's all right so lights. i don't and then there and then that one i just blinded your camera that's fine <laughs> but yes but so two settings on each one yes and then that one goes off very so, bright I mean, little light little little bitty i mean tiny yep tiny little thing so how much them are these are only twenty four. Twenty four dollars. No, like twenty three and some change. So we're gonna round up twenty four just to be, you know. Uh, I believe the last time I priced our stream lights back there, mm -hmm. they were around thirty two, but that per distributor is different. Right. So. So here's the difference in them. You don't get a bottle opener, and you only get the end light. Yes, with only the, the end light. light. And which I'll grab oh, one of those. And they're three hundred twenty-five lumens. So. Yeah. It's, Double the lumens. So we'll grab more than one double of these. The yeah, and the only thing about these is, so you know, it has the little clip on it. Yep. You can stick them on your hat or wherever. I know some people stick them on the bill of their hat. Mm -hmm. I've actually had some people lose them because the clip the popped clip off. Pops off. Yep. And I was like, well, I can replace the clip. I can't replace it. That's the only negative thing with the stylus. Have you got any of them on here? Um, How the clips pop on? I'll give you an example. So the easiest way to fix this, guys, is take a piece of heat shrink, stick it over. I actually did what? this on one of my cool tool tip videos that I did. <laughs> you can put a piece of heat shrink around it, shrink it down, and then it won't pop off the light anymore. Oh, wow. So well, that's kind of like that. So, reading rainbow the more you know thing you know so that's how easy that is to pop off yep i love my stream light love my warranty on my stream light but like so you see it it just kind of pops on yep if it's in your pocket i had a guy right here i had a box with a one of those little white cords you know those hard plastic mm -hmm. cords that keeps it together lean over got a drink and then out he lost went, his. lost his stream light, and it was just hanging there. Luckily, you know, he got it back. So, There's as the you can size see, difference, so you guys can see them side by side. 
So it's a little bit bigger, but you're not going to be wearing that on your head. Mm -hmm. You're going to be clipping that on your bag or just, I mean. It's honestly, way brighter. And I like the side lights, what I like yes. about that light. Which, so. I've, Michael's worked a lot at night. So y'all have seen the pictures like I posted or he's posted or I posted to his page. Mm -hmm. And we've had those big old bulky lights. Well, sometimes. He goes underneath. You can't take that hood light underneath with you. Yep. And then sometimes those hexagon lights or any of the other lights are just too bulky. So this has a strong enough magnet that you clip it mm -hmm. to plenty of metal down there. Just don't forget it. Just don't forget it. Don't forget it. <laughs> I'm sure this magnet is going to hang on for dear life, but just yep. don't forget it because don't forget it. we've had people with those hexagon lights, you know, have to they, wait for them to come back. Yes, we had one that he actually tracked it to California and watched it come back and as soon as it got back to the yard he went out there and got it it was dead of course because he had left it on but somebody else made a comment did they not see you know going down the road a bright light and it's like well <laughs> it could have died by the time you know it made it to that point at least it hung in there it did but uh these are going to be in stock ready to go so okay. what's the warranty on them i believe they said a year on this and they're not going to send them in so just swap them out swap them out there you go that Easy is enough. kind of the best warranty, in my opinion. It is, without a doubt. Because nobody mean, wants to send nothing in. Exactly. Because you buy a tool because you need a tool, and you pay for tool truck service because you want it serviced. You want it right then, right. right now. And we've been apologizing for days where our streamlight, you know, stuff, but it's supposed to be coming in. So we, you know, we take ours off the shelf. We swap it out right then. We don't send it in mm -hmm. unless it has to be sent in. Now, if it has to be sent in, there's really nothing I can do at that point. My hands are tied. Yep. But we're excited about this little thing. Easy enough. It is. Can't beat it. <laughs> well, it's a cool giveaway yes. for a grill. Awesome light. And that's it. It's Friday. Y'all guys enjoy your weekend. Like always, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Check over for merchandise. Cool tools and discount codes down here. If you're not subscribed, take your finger and you click that button. Y'all have a great weekend. See ya. <laughs>